Yo, Mark here. <laughs> oh, I gotta see that. Yo, Mark here from Charlie's Guam. Welcome to our mukbang relay show. Well, here you go. And now it's your turn. And please don't forget to subscribe to us and smash that like button. DM us on IG, Facebook, and hit us up at GPO Guam. That's it. Now it's your turn. Okay. So my name is Maria Kaigulao, not Kaigulinan. Usually people think that I'm a Kaigulinan. No, it's Kaigulao. And I'm 18 years old, and I go to University of Guam. Hmm. I'm Jackie, Jackie Chen. Not Jackie Chan, Jackie Chen. <laughs> and uh, I'm 18 as well. Well, what else did you say, Rose? I said I went to Yoji. Oh. She, she went to Yoji. I'm, I'm at Yoji right now. Hey, hey guys. <laughs> My name is Georgette Mateo. I am 19. I just turned 19 recently. Um, I also go to the University of Guam. Is this our mukbang? Muk, mukbang or muk? I say muk, mukbang. Mukbang. Yeah. Mukbang. Okay, so okay. I got <laughs> the chicken buffalo <laughs> and the bacon and cheese fries with a strawberry lemonade. And I got the barbecue cheddar. I think that's what it's called. The blueberry lemonade and the ultimate fries. And I got the chicken teriyaki. Looks good. I just got the regular cheese fries and then I also got a peach lemonade. You didn't even... Oh my god. <laughs> Why are you so fast? <laughs> you didn't even tell me you were going to try this is a mukbang. Okay, okay. I guess we're going to try to drink now. No, we're going to try to drink. I already drank. I didn't know we were going to drink it. Okay. Alright. Okay, how does it taste? It's very good. It's actually really good. Yeah. I tried the um, strawberry before. I haven't tried the blueberry before. I tried the peach before. I wanted the peach. But got into an argument before. Yeah, she's like, we should all get different drinks. So I was like, okay, okay. first time. I tried blueberry. <laughs> what Pretty does it good. Taste like? Tastes like blueberry. <laughs> blueberry lemonade. Okay, I actually have never tried the peach lemonade, so I'm gonna try it first time. Ooh. Peachy? <laughs> 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 okay, so we're gonna start eating. Should we try the fries first or the sandwich? Or we're gonna try it at the same time. Fries. Okay. Fries first. Right. Okay. Oh, <gasps> if Sorry. you notice, they're always like, it's like <laughs> an order. Because they're always just cheese and then you add some bacon. Can we just try everyone? And every, like, can we try everything? Okay. 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 Oh, okay. Wow. Okay. <laughs> you gotta check okay. it out. <laughs> okay, ready? Okay. One. Hold on, hold on. Okay. One, One two, two, three. It's good. Obviously, it's good. I actually had this before, so like. Yeah, me you too. You know what I feel like? I already kind of knew how it tastes like, but it's like. I feel like I'm good. eating the. You know the episode of Hannah Montana? What? Where they mix a. Uh, Jerky, Jerky and cheese. cheese. <laughs> Wasn't there a song? I'm not gonna sing it. <laughs> okay. Um, hey, honestly, every time I go to Charlie's, I always get the fries. I just think the fries are like the best thing to get. I never tried They're the ultimate have. fries. I've tried this one, but not that Try one. It. I love how I stopped it. I know like the same. It's just with ranch on top. Okay. Time for burgers. Oh, not burgers. No. Really sick. <laughs> Okay, sandwiches, yeah. our sandwiches. Oh my gosh, I'm a messy eater. Me too. I'm really scared. How, how do people eat this? Okay, you know, like this. I got you. Okay. Ooh, mine looks juicy. Mine is juicy. Okay. Did you see that? Oh my gosh, it's still hot Ready? too. Wow. Ready? Wait, 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 wait. I'm scared. <laughs> okay. I'm ugly. Why are you I'm scared? ugly eater. <laughs> okay, one, two, three. <laughs> Oh my god, that's so good. It is my first time trying the barbecue one. <laughs> and it's like really good. You know what mine tastes like? Hot wings. Really? Hot wings in a, in a, in a sandwich. I wonder why, you know? <laughs> Chicken, so, Chicken Honestly, buffalo. Honestly, this is really good. <laughs> Let me get another bite. I want more. Right, let's do an ASMR. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to ASMR. <laughs> 
<laughs> They're probably into that. I'm not into that, but to each their own. Okay, guys. So the topic for today, we want to talk about zombie apocalypse. Let's go. What about the zombie apocalypse? <laughs> Okay, okay so if there was a zombie apocalypse, what would your choice of weapon be? Maybe, um, I don't want it to be violent. Why? Violent. Okay, fine. Um, maybe... <laughs> what weapon is not violent? A pad. A pad? A pad, yes. You play PUBG too much. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A pad, okay. Maybe a little Okay, okay. If I were to choose... A weapon. I would choose a machete. I was gonna say like a sword. Too. A sword? A machete. Have you guys watched Walking Dead? No. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, I forgot the character's name. But she has a sword. But she's like one of the best characters. Because like swords, they don't need ammo. But the zombies like, from World War Z is really scary. Uh, no, we're talking about slow zombies. I know, but still, I'm just not talking about World War Z. Uh, okay, okay, so my what? All right, all right. Okay, my choice of weapon for a zombie apocalypse is um, so at first I was thinking a bush cutter because then like <laughs> because you know like you don't have Do to. Do you know how to use a bush cutter? <laughs> <laughs> hey, but I can learn how. You know, if it if it means <laughs> if it means surviving, then. Yeah, I'll, I'll learn how to use how a bush cutter. You know how hard it is? Gonna, it's going to be okay, up to you know what? a bush cutter. <laughs> okay, but I'm changing my answer because obviously, doesn't a bush cutter need gas? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah okay, so. Maybe a chainsaw is better than a bush cutter. A chainsaw! It's more like Isn't it like battery operated? No, I think it's gas too. Gas. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I'm gas. pretty sure there are some battery <laughs> ones. I don't know. I don't know. I don't use chainsaws. Okay, so bush cutter, okay? Bush cutter. That's my final answer. Whatever. Mm. If we were in a zombie apocalypse, who would be the first one to die? Probably this one. <laughs> no, it would be her! It's you with your bush cutter. <laughs> this girl has a pen! <laughs> oh, it's pretty. Not a pen. Jackie, be honest. Do you think you're her? I feel like you. <laughs> Why me? Because, like, knowing you, you're gonna start, like, you know, panicking. How about her? Right? I don't panic. Be okay, maybe. So, so like, you No, think about it. Like, honestly. Georgette. You just gone. Georgette, it's you. Why can't we pick on Jackie? I don't think. Ja I think Jackie. That's not smart enough. Wouldn't be the last. Wouldn't be the first one to die, but he would definitely die. Okay, yeah, may maybe that's me. <laughs> Like, I don't think I'm gonna make it through a zombie apocalypse. So, um, how's life going so far, guys? <laughs> Honestly, I haven't been doing anything this break. <laughs> same. I'm same. This has been working. <sighs> you guys should work too. <laughs> if you guys want, catch this guy at Cold Stone. Which one? Sponsor. Um, I work at Cold Stone at the mall. I also work at the yoga bar too. I actually found out about this thing. Through my co-worker, Lauren. Shout out to Lauren. She did a mukbang with Gabby. Shout um, out to Gabby. Yeah, shout out to Gabby too. Shout out to Gabby, love Thanks you Gabby. Thanks for letting us know about this. Yeah, that's like, that's how I found out about it. And I sent it to you guys, <laughs> but you guys didn't get picked. I got picked. <laughs> what is your favorite thing to get at Cold Stone? Hey, yeah. this is not about Cold Stone, man. This okay, is but I'm Charlie's. asking, I'm, but you work there. <laughs> Tell the audience what you would want to get at Cold Stone. I recommend sweet cream or brownie. That's my favorite. Why? What, what's yours? Sweet cream. Because sweet cream is not sweet. I'm not that into sweets. So no, it's about sweet cream. Sweet cream. Sweet cream. Well, sweet cream is like what? not sweet. Yeah. It's, it's still sweet, but it's not as sweet. Have you guys been watching any shows lately? That really popular one that's going viral the right Witcher. now. The Witcher. I just finished no. the Witcher. Are you talking about you? You. I love that. So I finished good. it. I finished it. Oh my gosh, guys. Yeah, if you me haven't. Too. I finished it. Deadass. Yeah. Oh, your language. Yeah, that's Sorry. Language. Just bleep but, that out. <laughs> well, but, wait, watch. But if you haven't watched You yet on Netflix, it's so good. Check it out. Shout out to Netflix. Did you or, watch season two? Yes. We're not going to spoil it so you guys can watch it. It's just so good. Just You're watch late. it. Why? 
Then you, you watch season one watch now? No, I watched both seasons. Did you watch it? Oh, you did? I watched season one like long time ago. But I know, me too. But did you watch both? I didn't finish season two yet, though. That's so good. I couldn't stop watching it. So 2020 just came around the corner. Uh, how is it treating you guys so far? Well, okay, so my 2020 is actually... It was actually a pretty bad beginning or like <laughs> towards like the end of 2019. Okay, so towards the end of 2019, I was like, okay, it's New Year's. I'm going to go get my eyebrows waxed. <laughs> but my face was peeling because I came back from Japan and my face was really dry already. So it's peeling. And I went to get my eyebrows waxed. And when he waxed it off, it my, waxed off his skin. <laughs> my skin went with it too. And so I was kind of going into 2020 like, oh my God, is my year going to be full of terrible eyebrows? and stuff so i mean actually into 2020 it's pretty good so far what about you jack um 2020 to be honest my philosophy for things is if you wanted to change you would have changed already you don't have to necessarily do it at the beginning of the year that's just me so i mean something new that i've been doing it's going to the gym more but i've been doing that for like about like five six months now yeah, really <laughs> I know, me too. <laughs> Shut up. But yeah, I think that's like a good thing going into the new year is um, getting fit, you know? I think that's really important for my life at least. I want to stay fit. You know what I was looking forward to in 2020? The mobile coupons for Coastal to expire. Mm. Oh my goodness, like. You know, my sister had one. So you I know, had someone one came in to our store with like. That's really Oh no, sad. I was helping next door, GPO. And someone came in with a hundred coupons. Like, we were about to make a hundred ice creams just for this one person. Did you so, do it? Like, yeah, we had to. So that's not like, oh my goodness, 2020, no more coupons. Maybe you know? it was like a birthday thing. Was it a birthday thing? Or they no. just wanted like a hundred ice cream, uh, ice cream, like. That's crazy. No, they, we, they got in the to-go containers. So they're like combined together. So that's what I was looking forward to in 2020. So you guys want to do some shout outs? Friends, family, teachers, wow. classmates. Shout out to my mom and dad because you know, if, if they didn't, if they weren't here, I wouldn't be here. I wouldn't be eating food, um, so yeah. Basic shout out, but shout, shout out to my out parents. Shout out to my sister. Her name is Sierra. She goes to JFK. So if you guys see her, tell her that I'm on this video. <laughs> and, and, and yeah. Well, she was really happy for me. She was actually pretty jealous that I was okay. Your turn, Jackie. Who do you shout out? I don't know. Shout out to everyone, you know, because everyone deserves some shout out. <laughs> shout out to Jackie because Jackie is the reason why we are here yes. today. Yes, thank you, Jackie. No. Thanks, Jackie. Happy New Year, Jackie. They really, like, on our group chat, we're, I told my, the group chat of all of our friends, we're like, oh, look, I got into that Charlie's mukbang. These two messaged me, they're like, can I go with you? Can I go with you? That's why I told them the idea. So yes, thank you, Jackie. Because if it wasn't for you, we wouldn't be here with you today. You're Eating welcome. this really good, drinking really good drink. Yeah, Cheers. Cheers to the um, mukbang. <laughs> Yay! Guys, check out Charlie's Philly Steak. It's honestly really good. I've never tried any of... Or I've tried the fries before, but I've never tried this before, and I think it's really good. This peach And it's pretty affordable, like, mm -hmm. this fries is only like three ninety nine. I think it was. I so, think of a lot. And it's- Like, just this fries alone will get you filled. So, so yeah, check them out. Right They're here at the GPO Food Court. Stop by any time if you're hungry. And yes, you Okay, know. so that's the end of our mukbang. Uh, please like and subscribe. You can press the subscribe button down below right here. You can watch other Charlie's mukbang like oh, here. right here and, and right there. And comment, comment down below what's your favorite dish at Charlie's. Mm, yeah. Okay, your turn. Like this video for more videos upcoming. And, and now, now it's your turn. turn. I didn't All know right. we were going to do the other hand. Did you want to do it again? You guys can do it again. Okay. Right, <laughs> okay, wait, can we go closer? Okay, yeah, Jackie, oh, yeah, we're, we're take it out. We're like, okay. one, two, three. And, and now, now it's your turn. turn. Oh, I forgot about the hand. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind, it's fine. <laughs>